Happy Mask Monday, friends. I hope everyone is doing well. Thank you for joining me here at Kimmy's Kitchen and more. Um, this mask that I am using, it's actually like a double layer type mask. That's why it's not fitting as well. The, the top one did not fit well at all through here and or here, but this, the um, or the bottom one I should say, but this top one fits a lot better. Um, I just haven't smoothed it out. <laughs> kind of got that like Jason vibe going on the day after Halloween, right? <laughs> so I hope everybody had a good weekend. <clears throat> For me, it's still the weekend because y'all know I pre-record. So, but anyways, happy to mask Monday. Um, so this is the mask that I'm using. It is called T5 Nourishing Tea Ampule Mask Black Tea Nourishing. And this was gifted to me from my sweet friend, Queen, over at Queen's Life. Thank you so much, Queen. It feels wonderful. And I know it's going to be so refreshing. I love to put a mask on, like, before, like, I go out. Um, I know a lot of us like to do it in the evening, so that's refreshing as well. But I find that when I do my mask, like, first thing in the morning, and then do my makeup and everything, I'm, like, so like shiny throughout the day not like overly shiny like you look like you know you need to put some powder on just shiny enough to have like kind of a glow about your skin you know what I mean so um this is written in Korean so I'm not really sure what it says because unfortunately I can't read Korean I wish I could how many of you all can read in different languages and speak in different languages? My daughter is currently learning Spanish, and that is wonderful. She actually wanted to do French, but the um, the school that we have her through, um, they don't offer French. Um, but they did say we could find a French tutor, and, um, you know, they could do the work. She could do the work, and then... Um, and then they could sign off on it and send it in and they would accept that. But I don't know anyone locally that um, is a French tutor. And, um, and maybe that'll be something for next year. I'll research for, you know, this year and for the summer and then find someone maybe to do that as a second, as a, as a second language next year. Or she'll probably take um, Spanish too next year. So maybe her senior year she could do French. So anyways, this is the mask. Thank you again, Queen. Um, and I am going to have a Dollar Tree haul with this video, so I'm going to go ahead and let y'all get into it, and, um, thank you for watching, and if you've not already subscribed to my channel, hit that subscribe button and the bell notification, you won't miss any of my uploads. I try to upload daily, um, so, yeah, um, and also, uh, so like I said, stay with me because I have this Dollar Tree haul. And uh, I'll see you tomorrow for Tea Tuesday. Hey friends, I hope you guys are doing well. I'm going to do this haul. I'm going to add it with my um, Mask Monday. So you already have had the introduction. Um, so let me go ahead and get started. First off, I needed these. Uh, hold on a second, try to get you straight here. Hold on. Okay. <laughs> I needed these Gain uh, fabric softener sheets, and they smell so wonderful. And you get 15. And then we also needed, I'll get the boring stuff out of the way. We also needed some Dawn. And I usually get the spray, but um, I do like to have some of this on hand, and we were almost out. And this is in the uh, Green Apple. And yeah, it's antibacterial. And then. I haven't tried this, and if you guys have tried this, let me know and let me know how you like it. It is eyeglass cleaner. It says safe for anti-reflective glass, plastic, and polycarbonate lenses. So, yeah, I'm going to try this on my daughter and her glasses. We don't wear glasses that often, but when we do, we want them to be clean, right? And then I got some of these canine carryouts, the beef and cheese flavor for our fur babies, which Max is... We're running to me now. Hi, Max. You ready? Oh, yum. <laughs> okay. Oops. Put that there. 
And then um, I found some of this Jet Puffed Marshmallow Cream. And I was like, oh, I better go ahead and get it now. Um, because you can make fudge with this. And you can also make the marshmallow fruit dip um, for like your strawberries and um, blueberries and things like that. So I got one of those. And that's all you're getting, Max. And then my, my Bella girl, she picked out this e.l.f. Uh, jelly highlighter in cloud, it says. So she wanted that. And then she also got, well, let me show you. I'll show you what, what she picked out, and then you'll understand. Oh, goodness, Max. Did it get you choked up? Here it is. Sorry. Okay. Um... You guys have probably seen these before at the Dollar Tree. They are the um, Christmas trees. I'm trying to get that so it doesn't have a glare on it. It's just the mini Christmas trees. Um, let me see how big it says it is. I don't even see. It doesn't even say. Huh. But obviously very small. So she wanted one of those. Um, so I got her that. She wanted it for her room. And then she wanted this little birdhouse. Isn't that cute with the little holly on the top? Little pine and holly and the little pine coats. So she wants that to put on her tree. And then she also wanted these little gold and silver balls to go on the tree. There are 15 pieces and it's got like the glitter. You can see it's got the glitter on it. So she got, um, I got her those her room and then she also got it in the red and the top ones have glitter and then these are just the regular balls so for her tree and then I needed to pick up a sympathy card for a friend who whose dad recently passed away I'm sorry not her dad her husband my goodness um stop it Max He's been out of control lately. He's driving me crazy. Um, I did pick up one more of these. I need to get a few more, but I did pick up another one of those, the Angel Wings ornament. I picked, I picked up a thing. Of it. Let me move this back and probably help so you can see a little better. Hold on. Um, I picked up a thing of the Scott, Scotty tissues. Um, I love the beach scene. And then I picked up one of these solid spoons. It says it's dishwasher safe. I got one of those. Those are good for when you're making like um, scalp potatoes and things like that. This, this is always good to have. And then my other girl also picked out these little campers for her tree. She said, Mama, one for you, one for me. <laughs> and then... Um, I got this hairbrush for my son because his is starting to look rough. So I got that for him. And then, look at this. I love, love, love. If y'all know anything about me, y'all know that at Christmas time, I'm obsessed with nativities and have a lot of nativities. And, um, so, isn't that beautiful? I seen that. I told Bella. I said, oh, I have to get that. And then she picked up this one with the deer. Isn't it pretty? You know what? I think I'm going to go back and get a couple more of those if I can find them for my friend Robin. My friend Robin and Frank, they love deer up in West Virginia. And look, Miss Brenda, I found the pom-pom trim. I got it in the green and I got it in the white or the red. They had the white, but I did not get it. But I thought these would be so cute when you're like making cards. You could like line them. Um, if y'all have any other ideas for these for crafting, please let me know. Just comment down below and please let me know. And then I got a couple more of these. Um, this is the Copper Kettle Candy Company. It's the dark chocolate caramel with sea salt. I'm not a dark chocolate person, but I can eat it in these because the sea salt and the caramel overpower the dark chocolate. Just like with the peppermint patty, the, the, the peppermint part overpowers the dark chocolate, so I can eat those 
Although dark chocolate is healthier for you, I'm more of a milk chocolate person, but I can eat those. Those are really, really good, guys. If y'all haven't tried them, I recommend them. And then I was looking for the plastic, you know the little plat that almost looks like a, um, a shower cap, the plastic uh, wraps that you put over your, um, your containers? I was have been looking for those, and I cannot find them in our Dollar Trees. Um, so I just ended up getting these aluminum foil sheets. I love these, too. And you get 30. So um, I really like those. And then, let's see. Oh, and then my daughter saw these. This is the cinnamon, crust, uh, cinnamon toast crunch in the churros. Um... She wanted to try them. We've never had them, so she says, let's try those. And then, um, she also got the, um, hot chocolate and the marshmallow, with the marshmallows, because it's getting to be that time of year now, guys. I mean, not so much for us here in North Carolina, but it is cooler in the mornings. And then I picked up a thing of the Betty Crocker chocolate chip cookies. And it says it makes 12 two inch cookies. And then I also picked up, I've never bought this at the Dollar Tree before, but I got the Azul Premium Light Brown Sugar. Max, stop. Oh, my lands, you're driving me crazy. Um, and then it's like I created a little monster, didn't I? And then I've never gotten flour from the Dollar Tree before either, but this is the Nancy Jane all-purpose flour. Um, it says it's good until February 14th of 2023. So yeah, um, like I said, I'm going to put this video with my Mask Monday, so I hope you all enjoyed the Mask Monday, and I hope you all enjoyed the Dollar Tree haul, and I hope you all have a wonderful, safe, blessed day and the rest of your week. And until next time, bye y'all.